Isn't it hard to live such a schizophrenic life where one deals only intellectually with issues and not in, uh, in combination? Who says that it's schizophrenic? What is schizophrenic is for a chemist all day to work in a chemistry laboratory and on Sunday to go to church and to say this wine is blood and this uh, bit of bread is flesh. That's schizophrenia. It's schizophrenic for you uh, to walk down the street and have a perception that there might be angels or life after death. That's schizophrenic because you are dealing with that which is not there. You are outside of the realm of verifiable experience. And you know that and I know that. The atheist position is that all children are born atheists. And after they are born absolutely without religion, they are indoctrinated into a particular religion. And that religion is always an incident of A, time, and B, place. So that, for instance, had you been born where you were born, here in America, 600 years ago, you would have believed in the great spirit and you would have believed in the kind of pantheism that the Indian community into which you had been born would have believed. Uh, if you had been born in China, you would probably have been, uh, you would probably have been uh, a believer in the Taoist religion, or if you had been born in India, you would have been a Buddhist. So it is always an incident of time and place according to your indoctrination, but every child is born an atheist. Um, first, I'd like to ask Ms. O'Hare to define her, um, her, the word atheism. An atheist is simply a person who is free from theism. Only that and nothing more. Absolutely nothing more. Okay. Um, earlier in the program, I heard you say that um, an atheist has no belief in anything. No belief systems. Okay. Well, then um, that's just totally ironic because if you don't believe in any system, you're believing that you don't believe in any system. So you now, would you go and look up in the dictionary the word belief, and you will see that it is an unfounded proposition not supported by reason or arguments or even by observation. A belief is something that you accept on faith. And we don't accept anything at any That's level your on faith. That's your definition. Isn't oh, it? come on. It's, it's like, it's like the, it's a, 